From Burbank to Bangkok, Anugo is the story of two brothers who've taken a family passion into a global business. Anugo is one of the most innovative expat success stories you'll find in Thailand. Their apparel design and manufacturing operation, located near Bangkok's Sikon Square Center, consists of a team of designers, sewers and printers who utilize some of the latest technology for cotton and sport polyester printing, as well as a whole range of merchandise for their clients. Barrett and Vic Lepegian developed their interest in visual arts at their parents' Burbank, California photo lab when they were children, and their business brand Anugo is taken from their parents' first names. Uh, that's my that's my parents. That's actually Anugo. This is Anush, and that's Isgo, which makes Anugo. The famous faces whose pictures were developed at their parents' lab adorn the walls now at the factory. These were uh, some of our clientele from the from the Burbank days. Um, you know that that's Billy Idol. You know we did a lot of rock and roll. This is uh, Nancy Wilson from Heart, from the band Heart. So who's this one? This is actually Ron Howard with his wife. This is uh, probably the very first celebrity photo that, uh, that was autographed to us. This is from 1976. Um, Ron Howard and his uh, entire family were customers of ours back in the day. His, uh, uh, his brother Clint and his mom Jean and his father Rance all used to be neighbors of, of ours. And we used to do all their photos. And, uh, and this was uh, Ron Ronnie Howard and his wife used this as their um, Christmas card in 1976. If you need reusable fab stickers, alumographs on metal, posters on fabric, printed or stitched caps, cushion covers, bags, sports shirts, or fashion apparel that's made to order, and then branded or printed as you desire, then this is the place to head to. 0506, you know, our, our, both of our parents passed away, you know, my mom and my dad. And then and the business after 35 years was definitely taking a different shift. You know, everything was going digital. A lot of what we did was sort of uh, becoming less and less relevant as far as film and custom printing. And then so we sort of decided, you know, uh, the, the future is, was not looking bright for the exact business we did. So that's when my brother decided, you know, I might do a change of pace. You know, I might try and go and live in Thailand. And, you know, I, I thought that was a great idea. And that's how, so he's the first one that came out about 10 years ago. Part of what we do, and I think it's really fun, is we'll come up with a design and then all of a sudden it's, uh, let's put a logo on that. And let's incorporate that into some type of a marketing list different ways of uh, making cool stuff, but that can also be business wear. So that's really the fun creative part. I love being creative, working on the computer, and when you're actually making something and you're wearing it, it's uh, a lot funner. I don't want to say funner, but we used to make books and photos on the wall. We do types of that too. But making something that you wear is just, it's really exciting for me. It's yeah, me too. That's yeah, wonderful. I was at the Anugo Manufacturing and Printing Factory in Bangkok for something special. During COVID, I began painting in my living room to fill the time, and the end result was a sizable and somewhat colourful collection on canvas. Having discovered that Anugo offers a white label e-commerce solution for artists, I wanted to see if my art could be more functional. The other part of the business here at Anugo is e-commerce. So if you're an artist or a business and you want to put your picture or your brand onto some merchandise, you can literally go from the computer to a finished product in no time at all. So if I want to get my painting onto a t-shirt, then I've come to the right place. In terms of e-commerce, you're actually now offering that to, to people who want to have merchandise. Yes. For an individual or for a company. Yes. And, uh, and how, how do you actually operate that part of the business? Sure. There's multifaceted ways to do that. And we have customers that actually can do, that want different types of things. 
So for example, if somebody has no presence at all, they might have an Instagram page or some type of social media and they want to sell, we could set them up with uh, one of the shops that we have where they have a page, they list 10 things, and uh, you know we make the mock-ups and they're ready to sell. They may not even have an ability to take credit cards, but we simplify all of that where we have a page and a shop and they, customers can buy or we have some customers in the U.S., something called uh, Shopify. It's a big platform, yes. and it's quite costly. And they may have someone that's uh, running that, and they may need some help. Where well, we can offer a little bit of help there for mock-ups or offer the whole turnkey. It really depends on what the uh, customer is looking for, and we try to stay flexible like that. So once you've decided on your merchandise mock-ups, the designs are sent straight to the screen printer. There are only a few of these machines in Thailand which can print six color. Vic told me more as I watched my first printed t-shirt emerge. So this is the printer and she's got pallets. And what we do is sometimes we'll put smaller sizes for infants and kids and sleeves and things. It prints on here and then it just goes right into the dryer. I call it the cookie dryer because it just slowly creeps in. This takes about 10 minutes. When it comes out on the other side, it's ready to wear. It's done. The machine has the capability. You could be running two separate jobs at the same time. So productivity, this thing is, uh, is really amazing, which is why we made the investment in this. Because same day shirts are no problem. We could. We also offer things within a few hours, which was just impossible just a few years ago. A quick run through the dryer, and in less than an hour, three of my paintings were now wearable art. It's a different process to add designs to polyester, but Anugo is unique in offering both options. this way and not screen print? That's a great question. There are two different processes for cotton and polyester. It's just the way it's done. Uh, especially to do the all over fabric, this is just the process that's best for doing with polyester this way. So if your business needs branded merchandise, apparel or signage, or like me, you want to create your own shop online, then Anugo is the go-to place in Thailand. Mm -hmm.